Okay guys, uh, this is uh, part two. The setup is identical as the first setup. So I'll explain it to you once again. From the PWM, which is right here, the positive goes into the resonant rod by filer coil. Right here, the positive goes in through the, the long coil, comes out and goes back in, makes a loop, and then comes out and goes to the cell. So here, from the PWM, goes in, comes out, goes around and goes back into itself and then out to the cell. And the negative just comes straight back to the PWM. On that is a pickup coil. The pickup coil is right here. Ignore the magnets, it's just to make some sound. Uh, the pickup coil, literally one end, just goes to one side of the LED, and the other end goes to the other side of the LED back there. I have now added a second LED, <clears throat> and I have tuned it for both meaning that uh, if I just had one hook up, hooked up, it would uh, react differently. Uh, so I have this tuned for having two LEDs plus the hydrogen system, of course, which again is just set up uh, regular electrolysis, and you'll see that uh, when I turn it on. So when I turn it on, what's going to happen is the cell will start to bubble, the lights will come on instantly, It'll show the amperage going into the PWM from the battery. And you will see there is virtually no difference with the lights on or lights off. So let's hook this up as soon as I find the wire. Here it is. <clears throat> so I'm just hooking this up to there. I'll get you here closely because everyone likes to see the bubbles and you'll hear it vibrating right away. Uh, it's interesting on camera it looks like the lights flashing but it's not it's solid. So this is the production at about 1.45 amps, so a little less than one and a half. You know what, I think it's actually, the, I want to get into the magnetic field. Uh, the foam picks it up, it's very strong. You can feel it from probably a foot away. So let's, uh, maybe I can zoom in. Really picking up the field. Anyways, the light's not flashing, or at least I can't see it with my eye. <clears throat> Here's the setup. Again, PWM, positives going into one side, going straight through, coming back out and around, just like a Tesla coil, just like a pancake coil. And then going right through again, and then going to the cell. Uh, and there's just a pickup coil around it. Very simple. It's not that complicated. I do have a small cap hooked up to it. Uh, it does help increase the voltage. And then it's hooked up to the lights. So I've got one light there, which you can see. Uh, I can't see it flashing with my eyes. I don't think it is flashing. And I've got the other light over here. Again, my eyes can't cannot see it flashing. I'm not sure if it's flashing on the screen. <clears throat> Hydrogen. And so what do we got? 1.44 
amps so you'll see that both of these lights will turn off once I uh, just remove this probe and we're still at 1.44 back on 